Hi, in this video, you will learn how to edit column charts in our graph templates. First, let us take a look at the different types of column charts available here. As you can see, there are totally 15 different templates available here. Now, let us try and see how exactly the different column charts work and how to edit them. The first template that you see here is a bit more than a simple column chart. It actually provides far more information. For example, you can see that each of these columns has very clear labels. Now, how do you edit this column chart? It's very simple. Right click, go to edit data, and you can see that for each performance, there is a clear explanation given as to why certain things are higher and why certain values are lower. For example, as you can see here, in the month of March, the sales has gone down because of stock out reason. In the month of June, the sales has dipped because of holiday season. So this type of a chart helps the managers to understand the context of different numbers when they are sent this chart to them by way of a report. Now let us see how exactly to edit this. Now let us say I want to give a different explanation. So instead of stock out, if I want to say the reason is um, birthday of salesperson. And you can see that the change is reflected here. And if the performance had been say 21 because it is the birthday of the salesperson, you can see that the value has changed here. So that is how this specific chart works. It shows performance of different months and the associated explanation for each of those months. Now let me close this. Let us go to the next template. This template once again has a bit more information than the usual column charts. The information that you see here is the difference between these two values. For example, in this specific case, 52 minus 36 is 16 here. Same way 52 minus 45 is 7 here. So whatever is the difference between the two columns is entered here in this specific place. Now let me show you how to edit this data. Now right click and go to edit data. And let us say instead of 45 for the month of August, if I want to say the value has been say 62. You can see that immediately the change is reflected here and the difference is automatically calculated. Now if the difference, say if for the month of September the sales has been say 50 instead of 26, you can see that the change has reflected here and the difference is 12. So that is how this specific column chart template works. Let us go to the next one. This is a very simple one, a simple column chart with 3D style. And just as you would edit any normal column chart, you would edit this. Go to edit data and let us say instead of April value being 47, if I want to call this say 35, and you can see the reflection shown here. The key thing to note here, however, is the shape of the bevel is maintained. Let us go forward and this one shows golden bullets. There is no big difference between this template and this template. The only thing that differentiates this one from the earlier one is this beautiful background which makes this chart look more attractive. And we have this beautiful highlight which you can move to show a specific column. And of course the color is very attractive. So that is what is uh, the specialty of this specific template. And let us go to the next one. And here it shows stacked column chart in bullet style. Once again, this chart is included more for the aesthetic look and feel. It works exactly the same as any stacked column chart. Go to edit data. Say instead of 4.5, if I want to say 3.5, you can see the reflection. Take a look at this template. This template is to give you an inspiration of what are the various things that you can do to spice up your charts. As you can see here, this is a simple column chart. We have added a couple of elements like this 3D floor and an arrow to show the trend and to make the chart look more interesting. Now let us go to this one. Here we have added a beautiful background of the world map here to give a context for this column chart. 
Now this one shows average performance with variation. This is a very interesting chart because you can really see how this additional information makes this chart more meaningful. Let me go to edit data and show you what I mean by this one. Now you can see that there are three values here. Each day of the week and its wait time is shown here. These column charts represent the wait time and the longest wait and the least wait are reflected by this error bar. Now you can see this one is 22 and this is 6 in the case of Monday. Now let us see what happens if the least wait has increased from 6 to say 15. As soon as I do that you can see that the length of this error bar has changed. So that is how this chart works. This chart not only shows the values but also shows variations. Let us go to the next one. This one is a simple clustered column chart with 3D style and this is another variation of a clustered column chart and this one is a stacked cylinder with 3D style and this one is 100% stacked cylinder. These are all pretty much the same as any other chart that you would have seen and editing this is just as you would do with any other column chart. You just need to go to edit data and you can change these values and the change will be reflected here. We have got 100% stacked pyramid chart and cone chart with 3D perspective etc. Just to add a bit of spice to the charts and make them look a little more interesting than the usual charts that you see in a business presentation. Hope you really like the variety of column chart templates that we have in the pack. In the next video I'll show you another set of templates and how they work. Thank you very much for watching the video. See you in the next video.